Hello guys, welcome to my uh, fourth video tutorial on XHTML and CSS. And in this video I'm going to teach you how to uh, create some uh, bold um, words and italic and also some comments um, in your content on the web page. Okay, so we have the content of our web web page that we created here and we learn how to do the line breaks and the paragraphs and headers so let's just take for example um, the word web page okay and I want to put the web page word in bold so to do that we just have to uh, wrap it up with um, uh, some tags and the tag that you're gonna do you used to to put it in bold is the strong tag okay and as you will see web page now automatically is in bold okay um, if I want for example all this sentence I like this a lot in bold I just have to wrap this in strong as well pretty easy let me refresh in the browser and there it is okay so what about uh, italic well it's pretty easy too let us put the uh, web page word in italic we use the em and close EM for italic okay and as you'll see let me refresh web page now appears in italic you can use both strong and italic like this let's close strong okay let's see the result okay and there it is bold and italic okay um let's try let's just try for example colors okay how to put some colors in our um, content without using CSS okay later on in the course we will use CSS to put some colors but for simple words and sentences we will use in the XHTML code uh, I'm gonna show you how to put some uh, colors so to do this we just type font and then color and as you can see color appears in now in red which means is uh, font is a um, is a um, uh, a tag and color is a property of that tag so color equals and let's type here blue okay and of course here we close font now this little space goes here let's save this and let's see if this works here and perfect okay web page is in blue as I wanted to and we can still use for example um, I don't want to style this very much because we will learn later on with CSS but we can type here for example um, the size and we can type uh, 5 save this and let's open this and as you can see now it's uh, the web page is a little bit bigger with font size 5 okay uh, but for now let's just let's uh, just focus in colors you can try this with uh, red okay or yellow or whatever color you want um, now I'm gonna talk about comments uh, which basically is how you can make uh, your content um, not visible for the browser okay so you'll have the content and in the code but your browser will not 
uh, run that code or show uh, that content. So to do that, we just have to type uh, the less than symbol and this one here, exclamation, and close it like this here. Okay, so we uh, with these symbols, uh, the um, less than exclamation and minus minus and minus minus bigger than, uh, all this content will not appear as you see it's in green. Okay, so it means that this is commented. This section is commented and will not appear in the browser. Okay, the text editor will not read this uh, or XHTML will not read this code. And as you can see, if I refresh now, nothing appears. Okay, which means this section is commented. Okay, for example, if I want only the last, um, I like this a lot, the last sentence uh, not to appear. I can do this and close it here. Okay, so the last sentence is now commented and it will not appear as you can see. Okay, so you can um, still have the content in your code, but it will not appear in your web page. Okay, guys, uh, so this is all for now for this video. And um, if you have any questions, uh, just uh, post your uh, questions below or your comments, and I will answer them as soon as possible. Okay, see you in the next video. Bye.